today is an education summit that uh, hopes to revitalize the interest of education practitioners in our African culture. I am here today as a moderator for the very first panel session um, in the summit. This program has been giving us the opportunity to really connect with our own story, with our own background. For me, it's very eye-opening because there are some things that I didn't used to think about in relation to classroom instruction and teaching and learning um, as it relates to African culture. I think it's going to take a lot for us to internalize Afrocentrism across our schools and across our education landscape. It's not work for just one person. One of the foundational things that would need to happen within the Nigerian education system is really being able to get, being able to read ourselves of the inferiority complex that really pervades our society. When I was in a Eurocentric school, I certainly felt inferior because I thought white people are superior than black people. There is a misconception that success only looks like whiteness. I think people are part of the problem. Schools are only doing what they believe society privileges. At the national level, a law has been passed that the indigenous language should be a medium of communication up to the lower level of education. For us to be able to change things, we need all the different players in the ecosystem to be able to make a shift towards outcomes that privilege African ways of understanding ourselves, African preferences, African cultures, African, African languages. We have to think about decolonizing the curriculum. So anything that isn't relatable to the average Nigerian students, um, when you think about the examples given while teaching them, it should be examples that they can relate with. I wouldn't blame the schools because schools are run by individuals and individuals are educated by our own society. Afrocentric school is the future because it is time for Africa to rise. It's going to be a daunting task, no doubt about that. It's not a one day journey, um, it's a journey of a thousand miles. We're going to be at this for a while because it's taken many, many years you know, to, to get us to this point.